Hello, folks. It's me, Nana Jail Five Four Janet. Magic with a hospital thing on. Still, um, came from the doctor's office and um, and um, he's not in a hurry to do anything, so that's good. Um, he said I can wait a little while and see what I'm comfortable with. Gave me a couple new things that I can um, like different um. Before I could not uh, get in the shower, and I couldn't get any water on my wound, and he told me that um, he thinks it would be a good idea. So, you know, that's always a nail biter when they tell you you can do that after saying, don't get it wet. But um, I have home health care, and they're going to take care of me, and, and so that's a new thing, and that's supposed to be a good thing. So, um, God is good, and he's healing me, and it's taken time, but... Um, I, there's a reason for, for slowing me down and the Lord's going to let me know that if he feels like it. So I got to tell you, Miss June, this might be a two part video. Um, Miss June, um, June Angel Pews, um, had sent me a birthday present. My birthday was in March and she put together a birthday present and she said, I'm sending you a little something for your birthday. And I was like, Oh, thank you. You didn't have to. That was in, in March, and um, like I was checking the mail, checking the mail, and she was, you know, it, it, it didn't come yet, it didn't come yet, it didn't come, it didn't come. Anyway, long story short, it got lost and opened and gone, went, got went through, and the items, I guess, you like were unwrapped and stuff. It was, she said that, and, and it's funny because some, most of the times when something happens, the package is missing for that long, it's gone. Um, but there's a funny story that um, in her, uh, in the choir, uh, she's, she's at her church. She was talking to a lady in the choir and, about her, her package. And I guess the lady works at the postal service and she was saying how, you know, how it was like so upsetting because these items meant something to her that she was sending me and... And the lady somehow said there's a parcel at the post office that, you know, whatever. And like, and she said, and it's all opened and everything, but it came back. And it's so it, long story short, it was her package. So she repackaged everything and sent it to me. So I got it. Yay, I got it. So I'm going to show you. I already opened it with her on Skype this morning. Um because um, I just, it was so important that, you know, I just really wanted to share with her first that I got it. And I want her to, the fir to be the first person to see, you know, my happiness and joy. So um, let's get a start and not, and not in any particular order. Here's one of the cards. Let me see if I can find the, there were two cards. Um, I might have taken the other card out to show my husband. I'll show you the other original card in a minute. I'll shut the video off or I'll show it to you in my, in the last, in the second section of the video. Anyway, okay, this is the second card. Um, uh, this, it says, um, I know there is a card in here from the first attempt I sent. So this is for the second try. So, uh, it's so cute. She's so cute. She's so sweet. Um, and it says, um, can't find your birthday. If it's gone, this is a belated birthday present because she was looking again for my birthday when she resent this. Um, uh, if not, this is just because. Um, and <laughs> she says, because my brain has had it for today. So anyway, so there's a, there's some sweet sentiments in here. And um, I truly believe that the, the Lord brought us together. We're sisters in Christ. Um, we have so much in common and, um, anyway, I love, I love you, Miss June. So, um, okay, so that's a note that goes on something else. So everything's going to be out of order of what I opened it because, um, you know, I can't make long videos because I'm, uh, Apple's not smart. So she sent me this vintage bookmark and it says... To let you know I'm thinking of you. So I'm going to put this in my Bible. Or you know what? Better yet, we're reading this book together. This was sent to me. <gasps> Father, I didn't write her. 
This was sent to me by one of my Skype sisters. I think this was sent to me by Shirlene, I believe. I'm not positive. I will have to look in my thing. But I'm going to use this in here to mark because June went out and got the same book. She went right away and we read it and talk about these scriptures together. So um, that's like a daily verse thing. All right, so I'm going to pull this out. What is this? This, this, this. Oh, this was the first thing I pulled out of the bag. And you're not even going to believe this. I'm going to talk while I show them to you. These, she said, are like 1950s appliques. And they are seashells. Look at that. Is that beautiful? This is the back. That is beautiful. And, um, and they're all different kinds of seashells. Conch shells. Um, and um, this is perfect because I've wanted to do a black and white um, picture photo of, because, you know, I grew up here in South Florida all my life. And from the time we were babies, we were on the beach. And I have so many pictures of us and our parents at the beach. Um, and I think this would these would be beautiful on a fabric book with those black and white photos. Um, so that is, these are so special. These are from the 50s. I was born in the 50s. Holla! So thank you so much, Miss June. And um, six minutes, six minutes. Oh, she sent me these. This is some postcards of my church. Um, do go and look at, and she gives the website here. And um, this is a very, very old church. Um, and it says, my church has a website, Holy, Tri Tr uh, Holy Trinity Coventry. Um, when I sing in the choir, I stand on postcard number one and two under the pulpit, at the end of the choir stall pew. That's her little note to me. And um, seven minutes, doggone it. Okay, these are the windows, some of the windows in her church, stained glass. And um, she said um, some were blown out and reconstructed in the war. This is a very, very old church. It's just absolutely gorgeous. Look at Jesus and the cross right there. Uh, there. Look at the, that is just absolutely magnificent. Um, and then, um, and then this, this is what you see when you walk into her church. She sees that every time she goes into her church, she sees that. Is that wonderful? That is, I love churches that have a holy feeling. You know, we know that the Lord's with us everywhere we go. But there's something about the reverence and the respect um, that's due our Lord. And I love that. Um, there it is. HTC, Holy Trinity Covenant. Um, you might want to go online and look it up. It's a beautiful, beautiful, historic, gorgeous church. And... Um, so she sent me these, and I, I love it so. And someday, it's on my list, I do want to go to England, and I want to vi visit some of the churches, and um, and um, I, I do want to go. So hopefully, I will get to do that. Now, it's nine minutes. Okay, I'm going to go to um, one more thing. Let me see. One more thing. Can I show you? Oh, oh okay. One more thing. Look at this seashell pin that she sent me I'm gonna hold it try to hold it very still so you can see it is that gorgeous that is amazing um, it's a pin and it's amazing I just love it and she sent that to me so um, I will be back and I will show you some more um, thanks for watching so this is a package from uh, Miss June thank you bye